Hello guys, I am Flash Isaac and you are welcome to my chemistry class. Today, I shall be taking you through benzene and its derivative. So far in organic chemistry, I have been able to establish that organic chemistry is the study or the chemistry of carbon and its compound, except the cusk of carbon, except the carbide, oxide, sulfides, and carbonates of carbon. These are the exemptions. Now, the compound of carbon alone is more than the compound of every other element combined. This is as a result of the unique ability of carbon to catenate, combined with itself and other elements to form long chain and branch chains. While hydrocarbons, on the other hand, are compounds that contain carbon and hydrogen alone. Compounds that contain carbon and hydrogen alone. And dealing with hydrocarbons, I said that we have aliphatic hydrocarbon and aromatic hydrocarbon. Aliphatic hydrocarbons are those that contain stretch chain or brown chain. For example, if I give you C, C, H, 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 H and H, this compound is a hydrocarbon. It contains carbon and hydrogen alone. It contains two carbon and six hydrogen. This is an arcane or ethane. Then we have some hydrocarbons that contain double bond. If this is a double bond, it simply means that we can no longer have six hydrogens. Carbon can carry maximum of four bonds. Carbon is tetravalent. So we therefore remove this. We remove this. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. This becomes C2H4. This is an 18. Arkin. Then hydrocarbon can also have triple bond. If that is the case, then here goes, here goes. This becomes C2H2. This is the time. So arcanes, they are saturated. They have single bonds, single carbon to carbon bond. Arkins, E N E. They are unsaturated, they contain double bond, and arkynes, they contain triple bond. These are aliphatic hydrocarbons. They can be cyclic as well, or as acyclic. Now, aromatic hydrocarbons are benzene and its derivative. Benzene. Aromatic hydrocarbons are hydrocarbons that contain the benzene ring. Benzene ring. So what is benzene? Benzene is simply an aromatic hydrocarbon with cis carbon, cis hydrogen. It has alternating double bond. It contains alternating double bond. Benzene was discovered in 1825. And since then, a lot of persons have tried to propose the correct structure of benzene. It was 1865 when August Kekule derived or propose the best structure of benzene. August Kekule says that benzene is a mixture of this form of compounds above in equilibrium, which means benzene contains six carbons and six hydrogens with alternating double bond, double bond, single bond, double bond, single bond, double bond, and single bond. Now, instead of double bond, it can begin with single bond. Then double before double bond, then single bond before double bond, then single bond before double bond. This occurrence is referred to as resonance. The existence of benzene in these two forms above in resonance. Now, resonance is the existence of two or more structures to represent a particular molecule. The correct or the best structure of benzene is that of benzene in resonance, which means this structure or this structure is not fully enough to represent benzene because the double bond and single bond can be in any way. We therefore represent benzene in a form referred to as resonance hybrid. What does resonance hybrid of benzene mean or resonance structure of benzene? Now looking at this, this is the same as this. Double bond, single bond, double bond, single bond, double bond, single bond. This is benzene, and the corners are carbon, then hydrogen attached. Now, this is the same thing as this. 
single bond, double, single bond, double, single bond, and double bond. Since benzene can exist in this form, this implies that the correct or the most appropriate structure of benzene is in between these two. Therefore, we use this to represent benzene. What does it mean? It shows that this single bond or double bond can be anywhere. It can be here, double bond can be here, double bond can be here, double can be here, double can be here, and double can be here. As such, we say that this is a resonance structure of benzene, the correct or the most appropriate structure of benzene, proposed by August Kekule. Now, aromatic hydrocarbons are benzene and its derivatives. The derivatives of benzene are phenol, toluene, xylene, naphthalene, and aniline. Benzene can be prepared by passing a time through a red hot tube containing complex organonuclear catalyst. Now, what is ethane? Like example I gave, ethane is an aliphatic hydrocarbon with triple carbon to carbon bond. Eight means two carbon, triple bond, so hydrogen and hydrogen. So this carbon has four bonds, this carbon has four bonds. The tetravalency of carbon is established. So ethane is C2H2. When you pass ethane gas through a red hot tube, red hot tube, containing complex organonuclear catalyst, benzene is formed. Once again, to form benzene, you pass a time through a red hot tube containing complex organonuclear catalyst. That is preparation of benzene. And remember what I told you. I said this class covers benzene and its derivative. Benzene and its derivative. What are the derivatives of benzene? The derivatives of benzene are compounds that can be formed from benzene. Now, this is benzene on its own. We take benzene to be this. And anytime you see something like this or something like this, don't forget that this is carbon, 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 this is carbon. Here is hydrogen, here is hydrogen, here is hydrogen, here is hydrogen, and here is hydrogen. Benzene contains six carbons and six hydrogen so taking the structure of benzene to be like this there are compounds that can be derived from benzene and how do we derive that if this is h h h if we remove this h and add oh or add o here the name is no longer benzene it's not a derivative of benzene so benzene with oh is referred to as phenol Phenol. Anytime you see something like this, it is simply phenol. It is the same thing as here. OH. This is the same thing as this. OH. Phenol is used as disinfectant. That is the use of phenol. And when you see benzene with CH3 on top, it is referred to as toluene. To lean. So we can refer to this as methyl benzene. This as hydroxy benzene. Toline as used as explosive paints and glues. And when you see benzene with CH3, CH3, this is referred to as dimethyl benzene. So if this is carbon one, this is two, and this is three, you say one theory dimethyl benzene. It is referred to as xylene. And it is used as solvent in painting, rubber, and leather industry. And if you see two benzene come together, like as you can see here, benzene, benzene, they come together, you refer to them as naphthalene. And naphthalene are used in plastics, dyes, and fears. Then finally, aniline. When you see NH2 attached to benzene, it forms a derivative called aniline. And aniline is used in drugs. Benzene undergoes electrophilic uh, substitution reaction. Benzene undergoes addition reaction. Benzene is sp2 hybridized. Then benzene is colorless and it has sweet smell. Sweet smell. The reason it is referred to as aromatic hydrocarbon. So in summary, aromatic hydrocarbons are mainly benzene and its derivatives. The derivatives of benzene are phenol which is benzene and OH, or hydroxybenzene, toluene, 
میتای بنزین زایلین دای میتای بنزین نفتالین تو بنزین توگیدر آنلین بنزین آن انهیش تو بنزین ایس ای کولولیس لیکوید وید سویت میل هنس آروماتی هیدرو کابون ایت ایس آروماتیک ایت سنس ایت هاف سویت میل دوز آر ای پروپرتیز آف بنزین ایت کن اندرگو ادیسون ریاشن ایت ایس ایس پی تو هیبردایز And the uses of benzenes are as disinfectants, explosive, paints and regular use, solvent in printing, rubber and leather industry, plastic, dyes and fuels, and in drugs. Ladies and gentlemen, that is it for benzene and its derivatives. I hope you found this class helpful. I am Isaac and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more amazing videos. Feel free to let me know how you feel about the class. Thank you.